Caught on camera, valley strangers working together to help a hawk stuck in a tree. It's certainly a big talker tonight. Yeah, that group of people getting creative to bring the bird to safety. ABC 15's Jordan Bodke walking us through it all. A beautiful creature. Uh that was stuck in a tree. When we're in triple digit heat, Vern Leland of Aquatic Environmental Systems is typically busy helping keep pools running across the valley. But he started off his week doing something a little different, helping get a hawk tangled in fishing line out of this tree, 25 to 30 feet above the ground in Tempe. Vern says they called authorities first, but ended up just jumping into action themselves. After a while, we kind of decided we haven't really come across too many tasks that we couldn't accomplish ourselves. So a group of pool workers and other bystanders push themselves out of their own comfort nest using a mixture of pool toys to get the hawk down, basically attaching a knife to the end of a pool skimmer. Free the bird by cutting the fishing string it was tangled up in. Vern says it took about half an hour to get the bird free. If we can help, we will. It's unclear exactly how long that hawk was stuck in a tree kind of like this one here. But with one phone call to the people over at Liberty Wildlife, they came and picked up that hawk. That hawk is now rehabbing inside until they're ready to be re-released out into the wild. Animals tangled in fishing line is not uncommon. Nathan Thrash with Liberty Wildlife was there to take the hawk in for medical care. He says dehydration and stress likely kept the female red-tailed hawk from moving around much. But when we went back later in the day, we learned there wasn't any major wing damage and she's expected to recover. Our criteria for releases are um, there needs to be the same species nearby and near a water source. And we want to make sure that we're not releasing them back into an area where this problem could happen again. Nathan urges anyone fishing not to cut their line, but to throw it away to keep things like this from happening. For Vern and his crew, it's only Monday. Who knows what else they may encounter this week. It started the, the Monday off the right way. Jordan Bonke, ABC 15, Arizona.